my guys. I don't know what that was. Um, today was okay. I think I'm just really slap happy, tired, craziness. Um, I just have not been able to sleep through the night in over a week now, and um, it's starting to catch up with me. It's not that I'm not getting sleep. It's just because I have to wake up every like every hour and a half to two hours with my aunt, and then I can't always fall right back asleep. So I'll stay up like another half an hour, and then that'll be even less sleep because by the time I do fall asleep, then she's up because she can knock out like that. Um, but I got some time to myself again today, so I went up and saw Autumn. Um, my sister has been watching her, and then. I went to the grocery store, well, oh yeah, I went to the grocery store, and then I went to Target and Ulta. I actually went to a lot of places, um, mainly because I'm looking for this new Essie nail polish that's in the cabana, and every time I go to Ulta, it's sold out, and Target has not updated their summer collection to summer collections yet, so it hasn't been there, and I, like, check every day, I feel like, um, well, not every day since I've been here, because I haven't been out every day, but... I finally went to the grocery store up near me and they had the collection but of course they were sold out um, and they also had their new neon collection was which was not sold out and I think I want every color um so but I only got one color from that collection but I got two more I haven't I for so long I did no bio nail polish and I just bought three in one day but from the neon collection I got the bouncer it's me it's a really pretty blue, though I tried putting it on and I feel like I'm going to have to do a lot of layers of this. I just did like test run and I did like three coats and it still didn't seem, but maybe with a top coat over it and my nails actually filed and buffed right. Um, and then I got Where's My Chauffeur, which is... Well, I think this was this. I think this is the in the resort one, or it might be just. It was it. I don't know. Um, it's just a really pretty like. It looks. It's kind of kind of like a bluish, green, which is my favorite color, and I'm pretty sure I have, no joke, five to six similar colors. They're all just slightly different, but it's just it's my absolute favorite color. So every time I see it, I need to get it. <laughs> which explains this one as well. This is um, first timer and this is this is more green than blue. But again, it kind of reminds me a little bit of mint candy apple, but mint green is just my favorite color. Um, so I will be using those. And then I also got this from Target, Revitalift Miracle Blur. Um, and I keep seeing this, but it's like $20 for the full size and this was only like six or seven to, just to try it out. Um, I don't necessarily have wrinkles, but I do have lines and it says pores and that's mainly what I wanted to get it for because every time a new product comes out for pores I'm all over it because I just, I can never seem to find one that I love love even though I do have L'Oreal's um, Magic Base Perfector, it's like a pink one and I love that. Um, and then I got some stuff like just some nail stuff, just some remover pads and clippers while I'm here. Um, and then the last two things that I got, because like I said, from winter to, oh and I got one more thing out of this, from winter to spring and then from summer to fall is my worst skin time because it's transitioning from winter to summer where it's really dry to really oily so I have to change my products up because I get dry patches, I get oily, I get breakouts, and then summer it'll just be oily and I won't have breakouts or dry patches. Just like winter, I had dry patches at first and then it was just dry and it was fine. Um, so I got two things to dry because I don't really have, like, because I never have problems with breakouts. Like, every now and then I'll have one, but I don't always have it, so... I thought maybe I would get a new acne cleanser and I got the Biore Acne Clearing Scrub. And it's supposed to clear and polish. Um, it's a complexion clearing. So I thought I would try, try this. It kind of smells like peach almost. 
Um, and I, like, I really like the scrubs just because I feel like it's deep cleaning my pores a lot better. But I also got the Clean and Clear Advantage Oil Absorbing Cream Cleanser. I got this, I picked this up first and I was, I want to try it just for the whole oil thing. And I feel like maybe in the summer it'll be a lot better. But, um, I don't necessarily completely like cream cleansers. I just don't feel like they're ever doing anything on my face. Um, but I wanted to try it, so. And then the last thing I got was biotin and um this is really good for your hair skin and nails and i always like i think i've been to two or three jar like bottles of that and i can always tell when i'm not on it um it makes my hair grow a lot faster and my nails a lot stronger so i definitely recommend that and then the last thing that i wanted to talk about in this video um is my hair um I finally figured out a trick for my dry shampoo I put my dry shampoo in before I go to bed so the day that I'll wash my hair and then that night I will put like spray it all in and then I'll usually just put it up in like a light ponytail um and I don't rub it in I don't work it in and I usually go to bed looking like a grandma with gray hair but in the morning it's worked itself in and my hair is not oily at all like I might have some a couple little spots that might need a quick spray but it is seriously I've been doing it for now for almost two weeks and I love it because usually I go to bed and I'll wake up and I have really oily hair so the next morning it's just blech and then I have to use a whole lot and work it in um even though I did find the Batista Batiste Batista in the um brunette which I really like too for the day of uh, but I don't like spraying that in my hair at night because it's tinted and I feel like it's gonna get all over my pillows but I still have been using the Dove dry shampoo and I absolutely love it because originally I realized that I liked it on second day but third day when I would wake up my hands on my hair would look the best out of the two days and I just figured it was because it had time to work like maybe like rubbing on my pillow just have more time to work it in and yeah so if you have really oily hair and you use dry shampoo you might want to try that because it's been amazing I'll just I'll wake up in the morning and the most of it's already like rubbed in I might have to rub a couple places and brush it or if I'm getting in the shower I'll just put a shower cap over it but yeah um I can't complain though I don't know if I don't know if it's coming off looking oily in this light but I don't know. I don't know where this video went. It just um, somehow became a Target haul. So yeah. Uh, I started Meatless May. I don't necessarily know how long it's going to last being here. But today it went well. Even though I originally thought a Meatless May was so I could start eating more fruits and vegetables. Um, and getting away from processed and more whole foods. But well, I had like potato soup today. So um so literally no meat but I don't want to take this as like okay I can have pizza every day now because that's not meat um yeah that's all right I just rambled and ranted and that's the end of this video so I'll see you guys tomorrow